Hello everyone, my name is John Kosniak. Welcome to NoTube channel. Uh, in today's topic, we are going to talk about some of the vocabulary words that you can practice. I prefer 10 vocabulary words, which are very important uh, for your daily activity learning when you want to speak a fluent English. Here are some of the 10 vocabulary words for today's lesson. Uh, before we proceed, I would like you to help me by subscribing to my channel. That way it will help me and motivate me to create more video. So here are the top 10 vocabulary for today's learning. Number one, ambitious. Ambitious meaning having a strong desire uh, to achieve something. When you want to achieve something, that's what is called ambitious. Ambitious. There is an example here that I would like to share with you. She is very ambitious and plan to become the CEO of the company. John Cot is very ambitious and plan to become a CEO of the company. Now you see, ambitious means uh, having a strong desire to achieve something. That's what it means, ambitious. Number two vocabulary that we are going to learn, diligent. What do you mean by diligent? Diligent means showing care and effort in your work or duties. Caring for something. That's what is called diligent. Diligent means showing care. Example, he is a diligent student who always submit his assignment on time. When you can be able to do something quickly before even delaying, okay, it means that you care. And the word diligent means caring, okay? Doing something before it is too late. Uh, number three, vocabulary word is improvise. Improvise means to create or perform something spontaneously without preparation. Example here, we have example for this word called improvise. The actor are to improvise is lying when you forget the script. Let's say, let's imagine you've been given a task, but you forget how to do it, okay? So, uh, in this vocabulary word, you are being told that you can come up with a new idea. You can create your own. That's what it's called improvise. Uh, the vocabulary word number four, it is called meticulous. Meticulous. What do you mean by this word? It means you have to be very careful and precise, paying great attention to detail. Being careful and precise, like when you've been given something, you need to be careful when doing that. Let me give you one example here. She is meticulous in her work, ensuring every detail is perfect. If, you be, if you've been given a, a task to do, you need to make sure that you look into those details Okay, because you want to avoid mistake. That's what we mean by meticulous, meaning you have to be very careful and precise in order uh, to achieve something. Uh, number five vocabulary, it is called resilient. What do you mean by resilient? Resilient means able to withstand or recover quickly from a difficult condition. Examples here. After the setback, setback means that what happened? Uh, he proved to be resilient and quickly got back on track. Uh, vocabulary word number six, eloquent. Eloquent, what do you mean by this word, eloquent? It means fluent or persuasive in speaking or writing. To be fluent, to be perfect, example here, the politician give an eloquent speech that move the audience. Eloquent mean to be fluent or to be perfect or persuasive in speaking or in writing. Number seven uh, vocabulary word for today. Collaboration. Collaboration. What do we mean by collaboration? The action of working with someone to produce or create something. 
when you are working with a team or uh, having a link with someone else or a connection or networking and you guys can do something together it is what is called collaboration collaboration means action of working with someone to produce or create something uh, we have example here the project was a success due to collaboration between the team members the project was a success due to the collaboration between the two members uh, vocabulary number eight innovative innovative what do you mean by innovative innovative mean futuring new methods coming up with a new idea that's what is called innovative innovative mean coming up with a new methods or coming up with a new project example here the, the company is known for it is innovative product that revolutionize the market vocabulary number nine perception what do you mean by word perception the way in which something is regarded understood or interpreted when something is interpreted it means that it is being understood and this is what we mean by perception vocabulary number 10 skeptical skeptical what do we mean by this vocabulary word called skeptical it means that you are not easily convinced having doubt or reservations like you are not easily convinced when you cannot be convinced easily you are skeptical it means that it is very hard for people uh, to convince you to do something we have example here in this example he was skeptical about the new plan and need more information bef before agreeing like he was skeptical about the new plant and needed more information before agreeing if you are somebody who is skeptical it is very hard for, for people to convince you even if people come up with the, a project you need people to convince you how it will benefit or how it will work that's what we mean by the word skeptical take some time to review these words practice use 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 them in sentences and try to incorporate them into your daily conversation or writing this will help you reinforce your learning and improve your vocabulary in english well this is what i have for you this tent uh, vocabulary word they are very important for your daily activity practice them learn them make sure that uh, you understand how they work also put them in the sentence make a sentence with this vocabulary word do not fear do not afraid do not afraid to be bullied just practice because you want to improve your English speaking isn't it? so please if you like this video share subscribe comment do anything with this video thank you for watching bye bye bye